What do you want to say yes to? So I've been reading this book for our sacred circle along with Reverend Rachel Harrison and there's so many wonderful little tidbits in it and I appreciate you letting me share them with you here and now. This is from the book um, Happiness is the Way by Wayne Dyer and he talks about people being a yay sayer or a naysayer like yay yes I can do this and I can do that. It's this unlimited I'm going to go for it I'm going to attack life and just live life to the extreme nobody is going to limit me including myself and then there's the naysayer that's like well and they kind of put their own blocks in their own way and they hold themselves back because they're afraid or whatever reason is there recently I added a couple things to my plate and People said, you're already so busy. You shouldn't be doing that. That's too much. They were they were really being naysayers to my plan in my life, saying that I should hold back a little bit, that I should give myself more time off, that I should relax some more. They were all naysayers. And I just kept saying, no, yay, yay. I'm going to do this. I'm absolutely going to have a little bit of fun. The concept of this yay sayer versus naysayer is delightful because I want to be a yaysayer. I want to say, yes, I can. What more can I do? When we were building the gardens, I had three people tell me there was no way I could build the meditation labyrinth the way I wanted it to be. I said, forget it, I'm gonna do it. And I did it and it's there. I am very much a yaysayer. If naysayers ruled the world, the world would still, the earth would still be flat. <laughs> Wait. We, uh, we wouldn't have telephones, we wouldn't have electricity, we wouldn't have cars or TV, those cell phones that you're on all the time. Naysayers keep you stuck where you're at. They don't want to try something new. They don't want to branch out of where they're at because that's a little scary moving into the unknown, into the uncertain. And yet, if you turn that around, moving out into the unknown and the uncertain can be so thrilling and so exciting. And when you do it, if you mess up, it's like, oh man, that sucked. But then you can turn around and you can try it again and then you succeed. Try, try again, get up and keep going. And then you get the joy and the excitement because you succeeded, you did it. You made the effort, you tripped, you fell a few times, you learned something each time that you fell, and now you've succeeded. And you have this added, yeah, strength, confidence, pride, joy, because you said yes. Absolutely, yes, I can. So what do you want to say yes to? What would you like to be a yay-sayer about? What would you like to embrace and say there are no limits in this moment. I am not going to be self-depreciating. I am going to stand up and say, yeah, bring it on. Let's live life and let's have a bunch of joy. Apply it, play around with it, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.